So we got to the top of Napton Locks and uh, we found the most gorgeous mooring for the night. A beautiful open field opposite us. And uh, I thought I'd give you a tour of the boat. So here we go. So this is the bow and uh, there's our gas container under there. So that's where we fill up with gas. And we've had a, cr um, a, a cratch cover put on, um, which covers this bit and gives you a bit of shade. And we'll come in. Uh, so this is where we fill up with water. Um, coming into the bedroom. So uh, take it in here. So we've got a quite a decent size uh, wardrobe cupboard there. Uh, another cupboard down here. And uh, there's clever storage, so um, there's storage underneath the steps as well. So we can put things under each of the steps all the way through the boat. Um, this, this shows us how much water we've got at any one time. Uh, so here's the bed. Um, and what happens is the bed actually slides out. So it actually fills this gap um, or, or most of the gap at night. Um, so the beds actually makes it wider and we've got a special mattress that actually um, folds back um, so that actually fills the whole gap so some more storage up here lots of shelving um, radiator and this comes through to our little office um, so we've got a, a, a lovely hatch on this side that opens up and then there's the office just put the light on there um, so we've got room for the laptop and uh, some more cupboards above and storage there. So it gives us this uh, nice little work area um, with bits of storage around in the middle. Come through to the bathroom. Um, so we've got an uh, open sink and then you've got uh, lots more cupboards. So they pack in as much storage as they possibly can. Um, even these tiny little cupboards here that sort of fit there by the loo. Um, so you can see that there. And then we've got a really decent shower. And when you're going along during the day, it heats up the water. So, uh, and that then stays hot um, till the next morning. You can have a shower next morning on the water from the day before. So there's a, into our dining area and uh, and living room. Uh, you've got the uh, the fire there, fireplace, which we're I'm sure we're going to use a bit more in the winter. We've, we've used it once so far last winter. Um, that there is the table, um, and we've got uh, a number of uh, poles that fit into those holes on the floor, and that gives you a table to eat off or write on or. Um, work at another hatch there in the middle but we do love the portholes each of the portholes you can actually open um, and in fact in the summer you can uh, you can take the glass out completely um, so it lets air in so those are really good and we've got this hatch at the top which opens up like that um, and again you can uh, use that for uh, Letting the air in, uh, our TV um, and bookshelves. So there we go, another radiator into the little kitchen area. Um, so we've packed as much as we can in here. Got a nice magnetic knife rack there. And there's our uh, spice rack. So you can sort of see there. So there is a, a grill and an oven. Um, we've got the fridge here and then we've got those sort of clever open out food things so you can pack loads into your cupboard uh, with those um, food area there is a washing machine it's quite small but uh, it's fine for doing small washes and dryer so washer dryer there uh, I've got a nice deep sink and again storage underneath the steps and cupboards both sides. So we've got a sort of cupboard there with all kitchen bits in, more storage for coats and things like that. 
and then we come to the back and um, that's the electrics covered um, underneath here is where um, you know every day I will actually sort of just check the engine and check the um, the grease monkey and, and make sure that that's done and there we go and come into the outside of the stern and we're back outside and that's a little tour of the boat hope uh, that it's given you an idea of uh, our living conditions uh, sort of uh, glamping really compared to what we used to so very very nice and, uh, and it's, it's absolutely it's been brilliant so far there we go